by this time you all know that babies they look similar to their parents for example in humans we all look similar to our parents right but does it happen in all the animals well no there are a few animals where the young one looks very different to an adult one for example let's say a frog so this is a young frog and this is an adult one do you notice that they both look so different from each other but if they look so different from each other then how does the appearance of a young frog changes drastically when it becomes an adult one let's find out so to understand this let us look into the life cycle of a frog an adult frog lays eggs now these are the eggs you see now these eggs they will develop to form the tadpole now these tadpoles are nothing but the young babies of a frog and they look so different from an adult frog right so over a period of time these tadpoles will gradually you know form legs hands and now they will become larger tadpoles and these larger tadpoles again after some time they will turn to become an adult frog now can you notice that this frog it is looking so similar to its parents yes so you just saw that the tadpoles they undergo drastic changes to become an adult frog similar thing happens with the silkworm as well so let us see the life cycle of a silkworm in the life cycle of a silkworm the at the young stage this silkworm looks like a simple worm but when it becomes an adult it looks like a moth so when this adult moth it lays eggs these eggs they develop to form a larva or a simple silk worm so this worm it is a simple worm which you know simply crawls on a leaf now this larva it turns into a stage which is called as a cocoon now inside the cocoon drastic changes take place to turn this larva into an adult moth so basically this is a young one and this is a adult moth but do you see that how different they look like right wow we have seen two cases and we have just realized that such drastic changes are taking place in frog as well as in silk worm to change this young one into an adult one right and these drastic changes are what we call metamorphosis so metamorphosis has been taken from two words meta and morphosis where meta means to change and morph means the form so we can simply define metamorphosis as the conversion of an of a larva into an adult one through drastic changes so students in this lesson you have seen on one hand where there are animals which give birth to young ones and these young ones they look very similar to their parents since birth but on the other hand there are some other animals which when give birth to young ones they do not look similar to their parents but these young ones they undergo drastic changes which are known as metamorphosis and now they become an adult one